Hey guys, in this video I'm going to talk to you about exterior angles in polygons. So remember, polygon is just a fancy word for shape, and exterior angles, well, they're these angles here outside of the shape. Okay, something really important you need to remember before you can have a go at these questions is all of the exterior angles in absolutely any shape always add up to 360 degrees. Okay, so all of these outside angles will always add up to 360 degrees no matter what the shape. So in this question, we've got a regular pentagon. So a pentagon is just a five-sided shape and regular just means that all of these lengths are the same and it also means all of the angles are the same inside the shape which also means all of the exterior angles are equal in size too. So if we have to work out the size of just one of these exterior angles, so one of these here, what you need to do is divide 360 degrees, because remember, that's the total, that's what they add up to. We have to divide by the number that there are, and there are five altogether. So we have to divide 360 by five. So, if you work that out, 5's into 36, well that's 7, and there's one remainder, 5's into 10, 2. So that's the answer to the first question. It's 72 degrees. So each of these exterior angles is 72, okay? Because remember, they're all the same because it's a regular pentagon. Okay, so it's just always 360 degrees, because that's the total, divided by however many there are. And that will work for any regular polygon, any regular shape. Okay, on to the next one. Okay, so this time there's no diagram, but that's fine. It says, find one exterior angle in a regular octagon. So an octagon is an eight-sided shape. So I'm just going to do a little sketch here, just so you can see what's going on. Okay, it doesn't need to be accurate. And remember, it's regular. So that means all of the lengths are equal in size, all of the angles are equal in size, and remember, all of the exterior angles, those ones outside the shape, they always add up to 360. Okay, so if we need to find one of those exterior angles, just like before, we need to divide 360 by however many there are. And this time, because it's an octagon, which is an eight-sided shape, there will be eight exterior angles. So we need to divide 360 by eight. Okay, so I'm gonna work this out. So eight into 36 goes four times with a remainder of four, and eight into 40 goes five. So that's the answer to the first question. One of the exterior angles in a regular octagon is 45 degrees. So it's exactly the same method as before. You're just dividing the total, which is always 360, divided by eight, because there are eight exterior angles altogether. So next, it asks us to find one interior angle. So we just worked out that the exterior angle was 45 degrees, okay? So outside the shape. Now the interior angle is this one inside. So we're trying to work out this one here, okay? So the angle inside the regular octagon. Well, because this is a straight line, Angles on a straight line, they always add up to 180 degrees. So you just have to subtract your exterior angle from 180, which gives 135 degrees. So that's the answer there. So you just need to remember that an interior and an exterior angle always lie on the same straight line. So they should always add up to 180 degrees. So if you know one of them, to find the other, you just subtract from 180. Okay, on to the next one. Okay, so in this last example, we've been given a regular polygon and we're told that one exterior angle is equal to 60 degrees. And from this, we need to work out how many sides are in this regular polygon. 
So in order to do that, what you need to do is write down the sum of exterior angles, remember it's always 360, and then you divide by one single exterior angle, so in this one, 60 degrees. So by dividing those numbers, I can calculate the number of sides, because if I do 360 divided by 60, this tells me how many exterior angles there are in total. And remember, the number of angles is the same as the number of sides. So when I calculate this, 360 divided by 60 is 6. So in this polygon, there are 6 sides. And that shape, that 6-sided shape, is called a hexagon. It's really useful to know the names of all these polygons. So that's how you work out the number of sides. You just do 360 divided by one exterior angle. Remember that only works for regular polygons, okay? When the sides and the angles are equal in size. So just remember that all important rule, the sum of exterior angles in any polygon always adds up to 360 degrees. So that's all from me for today and goodbye.